Hey, it's me and welcome to my channel, The Way What Is Truth. As usual, remember to like and subscribe and comment down below. Now today I'd like to share with you a true story of something that happened to me today at church. Now, I just went there, I didn't particularly feel like going, but I went anyway because I felt that it was the right thing to do. And uh, I stood up and I started to sing. And I think it might have been... I'm not sure how long I was there when this happened. It might have been like 15 minutes. I think it was 15 to 20 minutes after I arrived and I, I was singing. I wasn't feeling particularly great. It felt like I had the whole weight of the world on my shoulders. You know, my mind was all over the place. Uh, I didn't feel great. I haven't felt great for the past few days, in fact. In fact, I've, I've never really felt great since my early 20s, really. But recently, over the past few days, I've been feeling pretty bad. Now, unbeknownst to me, uh, an, an older gentleman called Alan Jackson prayed when he went there. And he prayed for the Holy Spirit to fill that church. Okay. Now, I didn't know anything about this. I found this out later. But as I was singing... I felt something touch the top of my head here. You know, it didn't feel like a human hand. It was some, the only way I could describe it would be, it was halfway between, you know, like a gust of wind and a hand and like fingers. And it was just very, very subtle, just lightly touched me and, 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 and then left. And I was shocked, I was surprised. So then I just flinched, instinctively flinched. I looked around, looked towards the scene for a few seconds and then carried on, carried on uh, reading the words on the wall, okay, and I, I, I carried on singing as normal, and this never happened to me before. Now, I've had other experiences. Take uh, when I was reading out of Matthew, when I started my I Read Out of Matthew series. Now, if you want to f see what God's Holy Spirit looks like when he touches somebody, and how incredibly humbling that is to be pressed by the hand of the Lord God Almighty, then definitely check out my I Read Through Matthew playlist, okay? And it's the first video I get touched 13 minutes in. In fact, I think the video is called I Read Matthew and Get Touched by God 13 minutes in or something like that anyway. But it's easy to find. It's on my I Read Through Matthew playlist. I think it's called I Read Through Matthew anyway. Um... And yeah, I was touched by the Holy Spirit in that particular video, and I've, I've never been touched by the Holy Spirit as much as I was then. When God touches you, you, you feel like you're about that big, you know. That doesn't mean to say that, that it, it doesn't make you feel small in the sense that you're worthless, or that you're nothing, but it, it, it's extremely humbling anyway. You know, he completely levelled me out, all of my pride, all of my vanity, everything just left. Yeah, so definitely check out that video I, I read out of Matthew and I got touched 13 minutes in. It's easy to find. Anyway, back to today's experience. It, it wasn't an amazing experience. I didn't hear any voices or anything. But this is the first time I've ever been touched. I don't know whether it was one of God's angels or just simply his Holy Spirit, but I instinctively felt like there was a presence behind me to my right side that was much bigger and taller than me. So it could well have been one of his angels that touched me. And that's the first time anything like this has ever happened to me. And really, that's all there is to say about the experience. I, you know, I mean, I mean, I liked it. I was a bit puzzled. Like, I thought, okay, what, what, what's going on? So I told several people. I told Alan Jackson, and he said that. He, and that's when he told me after the service was over. I went for a coffee. Okay, and um, I told him about it, and then he said. You know something, I prayed for this place to be filled with the Holy Spirit and I had no idea. And then that happened to me. So I just thought I'd like to, I just thought I'd better share this experience that I had. It's not that it made me feel ecstatic or fantastic or anything. It's not that it made me feel like I was on cloud nine or anything like that, like, like, like I'm walking on air or anything. But it, but nonetheless, it happened, okay? <laughs> So if you'd like to add anything to this video, then feel free to do so. And if you've experienced anything supernatural, anything to do with the Holy Spirit, perhaps you've had an encounter with one of God's angels. I hope and pray that it was a good angel, not a bad one, by the way. Because they can masquerade as good angels sometimes. Um, so yeah, I just hope and pray that you're all well. I'd like to encourage anyone who's watching this video to pray for me, to chat with me. If you've got anything you want to talk about or pray about, leave it down below in the comments section. 
And if you want to talk to me about anything that isn't even related to this video, then feel free to do so and check out my vids, check out my playlist, check out my community wall as well. And I just hope and pray that you're all right. I'm just thinking about what else I could add to this video that I haven't already mentioned. It was quite a simple experience, really, but it was significant. It was subtle. Definitely something touched me in this part of the head. You know, just enough for me to notice. I flinched, looked round, looked up for a few seconds like that, and then carried on, carried on, um, well, I wouldn't call it sit singing because I'm not a great singer. You know, but when I try to sing loudly, it doesn't sound right. I get all hoarse, mouthed and everything. I haven't got a great uh, voice for that anyway. I've got, if I sing low, then it's okay. But if I try to get louder, you know, like the, the likes of Frank Sinatra and Dean Martin and all of that, I just sound like a complete idiot. I sound like a mess. I have not got a singing voice. Anyway, um, bye bye and take care.